Thank you very much, please. Melania and I are delighted to welcome you to the White House on this beautiful spring evening. This is the Rose Garden for those of you that don't know, and we use it seldom, but this is one of the times we're using it, Tiger. It is my privilege to award our nation's highest civilian honor to one of the greatest athletes in the history of sports, Tiger Woods. Tiger, congratulations on receiving the Presidential Medal of Freedom. After clinching the green jacket, Tiger marched straight to his first coach, his dad, and embraced the man who inspired his enduring love of the game. Then Tiger turned to hug his mom, the steady presence throughout his life. That's true. I've seen that. I've watched that. And the person who told him that red is his power color. Wow, that was a good move. That was right. In the years that followed, Tiger launched one of the single most dominant runs in the history of sports. He holds the record for the lowest scoring average in PGA Tour history. Sam and Charlie, for all your love and support. Um, I love you guys so much. Erica, thank you. I mean, everyone has meant, you guys have meant so much to me in my life. and. Um, I've, I've battled, I've, I've tried to, I've tried to hang in there and I've tried to come back and, and um, play, play the great game of golf again. I've been lucky enough to have had the opportunity to do it again and uh, found a game that has allowed me to do this. And the, the amazing Masters experience that I just had a few weeks ago, um, certainly is part of the highlight of what I've, what I've accomplished so far in my life um, on the golf course. To uh, have had that that type of experience and to be able to come out on top and, and win, um, Joey, thank you. All the great reads too. Uh, I just want to say thank you again. This is um, an honor. I know that I'm the the fourth golfer to have received this award. Um, the late Arnold Palmer, uh, the great Jack Nicklaus, and um, Charlie Sifford, who is I always called him Grandpa because he was like the Grandpa I never had, and I end up. <clears throat> becoming so close with him that uh, I end up naming my son Charlie after him. So to have been uh, chosen as, as the next golfer um, after Charlie is uh, truly remarkable. So thank you again and thank you, Mr. President.